If a student is interested in dual enrollment, they must be in the 10th, 11th, or 12th grade. So I have a diverse group of dual enrollment students. You can be in public school, um, private school students, and I also have homeschool students. So um, it's open to anyone that's interested as long as you're in the 10th, 11th, and 12th and you meet the requirements. And that's, we're looking at your GPA requirements. So. Um, we have two different types of dual. We have academic and technical. So if you're interested in taking academic dual, then those are the classes that are going to transfer with you to your four-year institutions. Then you must have a 2.5 GPA, and our technical dual students must have at least a 2.0 GPA. If you meet those qualifications, then yes, you can, you can take dual enrollment. The reason I started dual enrollment was because, you know, my school doesn't really have AP courses, and at the same time, you know, why would I why would I do AP courses when I could be going ahead and getting college credit as well as valuable college experience that will serve me all the way through college, such as like preparedness, uh, understanding the college system, uh, learning how to communicate with professors, things of that nature. Since freshman year, my counselor has put it out that Shelton will be holding dual enrollment classes, so it's been on my mind. And then about junior year, I decided I was definitely going to do it for my senior because I had completed all my credits in December of my senior year. So I decided to go for it, and I went into the school and contacted with the counselors here and then got all the information and enrolled.